creatives so I just remembered I've never really done like an introduction for my YouTube channel so this is it hi guys <laughs> This is me. This is I'm um, called Rita Wanzika. Uh, my company is called Shooty Creations and Events. Um, my YouTube channel is Shooty Creations, and uh, yeah, this is me. I love I love design. I love to make new things. I love to create. I love DIYs. I love fashion. I love I love to travel like so much so uh, on this channel I wanted to have a mixture of two things one the fashion the creative bit the fashion the DIYs the interior everything of that sort and then I also wanted to have um, I also wanted to have I'll be doing vlogs once in a while just to show you a little bit about my life a little bit of my travel there is a concept I have that I want to be, I want to start, and it's it's a mixture of both my travel and my fashion. Uh, I'll be letting you know about it as soon as I recuperate, because I've been sick for a while. As soon as I recuperate, get back on my feet, um, I will. I will post vlogs. Let me know if you're interested in my vlogs, or I should just stick to tutoring those videos where you don't even see my face please let me know <laughs> maybe you don't want to see my face and you're like mm -mm, no we've seen it the first time and yeah we don't like it please just skip to that tutoring let me know i'll stick to that sincerely i'm here to serve you so um yeah so this is me Um, so I'm off to uh, do the donations that I collected from a few friends and family. Uh, I just got out of uh, sickness. I've been sick for about three weeks. Yeah, this is like the first time I'm actually stepping out, like real stepping out. Um, so today I stepped out because I was, uh, I'm supposed to do a donation as promised. Uh, for my birthday, it's something I wanted to do. However, I wasn't able to collect everything that I wanted. Let me remove the mask since I'm in the car. I wasn't able to collect everything that I wanted to collect. Some of the things are still in a different location. I haven't picked them, but um, I'll get some other time, pick them and take them to their to the families that I had promised to visit. And donate to so um, I have some things here in the car and uh, these are just a few things that I'm taking to one family that was closest to me and since I had promised that today on the 21st of August is when I am donating I decided at least let me take a few to this one family then when I pick the others I'll take them to the other families so a little about uh, and I have a colleague of mine who helped me scout the families that we were that we are going to donate to. So he's inside helping me do some more shopping, of, like grocery shopping. So um, we are going to add it on to this. We have some blankets, we have some clothes, um, yeah, things like that. Then now we are just going to get some few groceries for that lady. A little about the person we are going to donate to. She gave birth. She's in Uganda, what we call a nakawere. She's um, a, a new mother. She's she's alone. Uh, not like single, but her husband is away. He was deployed somewhere. He's in the army. So, And they've been going through a really, really, really tough time. To the extent she her, her, her giving birth, she gave birth on her own. Like she had no midwife, nothing. She couldn't make it to the hospital. They had uh, um, t 
told her to get out of the house so she had gotten us another place where she had started staying she had no one it was in the middle of the night the husband was not around so when they reached out to me i was like yeah at least that's that's a priority so that's why we decided today she's the one we are going to work on sorry not work on really but donate to uh, I also have some things for the baby, but they are, like I said, I have some things at the other location that were donated to me still to give out. So I'll get time and go there. And yeah. Oh, guys, I forgot to tell you, tomorrow is my birthday. <laughs> I had big plans. I had, I had, I had said I'm going to do like a luxury picnic kind of setup with my sisters. Do a photo shoot. Do like a launch of shooty creations. But guys, I've been sick for three weeks. Three full weeks. I've been homesick for three weeks. I've been on medication injections. Meanwhile, I even still, let me try to show you. I don't know if you can see. I don't know if it's visible. Um, you see those two black marks yeah that and the vein it's black that's where they were injecting I got five injections and yeah it was not easy every day I, had, I would go to hospital they would drive me to hospital take me get my injection go back home I was on medication for a full week and it was not easy but I got through it, so today is like the first time out of three weeks, minus that one week I spent going to hospital for the injections. Today is like the first time I have actually stepped out to, to like get out without just going to hospital. So I had to do this. Now I cancelled my birthday because, yeah, I couldn't organize it when I'm on my sick bed. And, um... I wanted to do like a DIY kind of thing, so I couldn't even hire. I wanted, like, it's something I wanted to try out doing. Like, I'm a hands on person, I like doing things on my own. Most, as long as I can do it, I would like to try it out. So, yeah. Um, so, the birthday was cancelled. Yeah, but I'm okay. I'm not complaining. I've had a number of them, I've celebrated a number. I don't know if I should I think it, it will I'll do a story time another time, not today not today, remind me if you need to know about it at Kazi as you can see and uh, because we are not sure where the place is where the lady stays we are asking for directions and are going to direct us to go there Happy birthday to you! Happy birthday to you! Happy birthday! Happy 
हैप्पी बर्थडे हैप्पी बर्थडे guys hi how are you so um today is the 22nd of uh, august hope my today is the 22nd of august and uh, it's my birthday yes it is my birthday today i uh, like i told you yesterday we were doing the donation so today is my birthday I was home like I said I had no plans I was home chilling just decided to relax and uh, cuz even when I woke up I wasn't feeling very well I wasn't feeling good about myself I woke up with a headache with a little bit of cold cuz even uh the weather is not so good it's a bit cold so it doesn't treat me nice and uh yeah I wasn't really feeling myself So just had breakfast and then went back to bed till about 1 and that's when a friend of mine asked me what I'm doing for my birthday and when I told him nothing I'm home he's like no come 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 let's go for lunch so here we are at Cassia Lodge it's in Buziga yeah I've come to have some lunch just enjoy myself Hmm. Yeah, I'm going to show you inside. I'll show you what we're having for lunch. And uh so it's a late lunch cuz right now it's about 4 p.m. Yeah. It's about 4 p.m. I failed to get ready in time. So yeah, we're here. Just it has a nice view. It's a beautiful beautiful place. You can check it out. It has nice food cuz I've been here before. It has nice food it has nice views yeah you can see the lake hope we find a, we actually find space on the uh i wish we find space outside where to sit uh, i don't want to sit inside so on the patio so yeah prefer us and uh so yeah that's how my birthday is going i'll be updating you soon Finally, I got home to cake cutting uh with my family, my mother, my dad, um my sisters. Just it was so much fun. I had to mute this because there was too much noise, too much noise. So we cut cake, ate, celebrated. Yeah, and that's how my day went it was beautiful i had fun i enjoyed everything 
and we had actually when we got to Cassia Lodge, uh, we found there another group of friends. So yeah, it was lit. Thanks for watching and please subscribe, like and comment.